Presiding officer, Beaufort's Dyke is a national deep water trench located in the north channel of the Irish Sea between Ireland and Port Patrick in the southwest of Scotland. It is also widely understood that at the end of the Second World War, instead of taking the surplus unexploded munitions to dump them directly in Beaufort's Dyke, which was approved as a dump site, often the weapons were dumped outside or around the dike site to save money and time. It is therefore a little wonder that we are now discovering more unexploded ordnance washing ashore. Presiding officer, according to the MOD, over 50,000 tonnes of explosives are disposed of in Beaufort's Dyke, just off the coast. In the Irish Sea, and in July 1945 alone, 14,500 tonnes of 5 inch 130 mm artillery rockets filled with phosgene gas were dumped. And in addition, according to documents from the Public Records Office, approximately two tonnes of concrete encased metal drums filled with radioactive laboratory waste and luminous paint were dumped in the dike during the 1950s. I have previously contacted the UK Government Secretaries of State for Scotland and the Secretary of State for Defence to ask whether a risk assessment of the stability of Beaufort's Dyke and around the site has been carried out, so that constituents across the region can be assured of its safety. And I have sought assurance that there are no future plans to use the dike the dikes site as a dump site in the future. Unsurprisingly, other than one response from the MOD indicating that they believe Beaufort's Dyke is to be safe and it poses no threat. I have had no response from the Scottish or Defence Secretaries and therefore repeat my calls for Beaufort's Dyke to receive a full safety inspection.